Hello world, I'm Rich, and it's Rich's World Beer Tour. Final day here in Switzerland. I don't know if we're gonna get in another review. Got the church behind us, sitting right on the edge of the Rhine. I don't know if you can see a bunch of ducks coming down. It's just been gorgeous. The sun's popping out yet again. It's been just glorious. And since I'm in Switzerland, I'm doing an Austrian beer review. I, I didn't have a chance to do one when I was there. Um, met a gentleman and I'll put some notes down below uh, when we were in Feldkirk. Uh, he runs a local beer shop and he had all sorts of great beers uh, and had it on tap and some of the stuff I'll, sh I'll show you when I get back I'll do a little review but we're doing from Beer All their Mountain Pale Ale. There we go. Their Mountain Pale Ale um, beer all, and this is, I believe, wow, Sonnendorf 27. That might be the address. Darn it. I'll, I'll try to figure, try to figure this out. Anyways, a pale ale, and he said this is really an American pale ale. Um, Pilsner and Cara malt, Magnum, Cascade, Amarillo, Man, Mandarina, Bavaria, and Citra hops. Uh, eight. What is it? 7.3% ABV, and I am stirring up some chunks. Oh, we're full of chunks. Me carrying it down. Oh, well. Um, so I tried a few beers in, in Austria. Uh, apparently, this is not like all the Austrian beers. This is something totally different. So I'm going to avoid that. I'm going to forget about the chunks and just drink this thing and enjoy um, some of the other beers I had. Oh, man, was that fun. That is just a golden, golden orange. Fingers worth the head. Really pretty. Dark orange. Malty, malty sweet. There's a musty, you know, it reminds me of some of the cheeses I've had here. Uh, there's just kind of a musty taste, a musty smell to it. But it smells sweet. And orange, yeah, there's some chunks. I don't care. Let's give it a give it a try. Cheers. Oh. Big, heavy orange, malt sweet. It just like what I was smelling. Oh, this is really nice. Um, big dose of orange. Tangerine. Um, grapefruit zest. That malty sweetness. Almost a caramely sweetness in there. The more I'm talking, that citrus piece, uh, a little pine uh, is coming out. This is for a pale ale. This is bordering India pale ale. This is really nice. Too bad we're off camera here. I've got uh, two huge white swans four feet from me staring at me wanting some food making some noise. Um, oh this is such a nice beer. This is not what I was expecting from Austria. A little pineapple just a little hint of tropical fruit but the orange and it's really sweet with that malt this thing I could drink all day this is a very nice pale ale um, this is one of the if the not best beer I've had on the trip um, just tons of pilsners tons of nice little lagers that uh, I've, I've had here um, some Hellas uh, Hellas lagers um, oh this is nice um, 9.5. This is really a nice beer. Um, I'll put some links, um, and I know it's a long shot. You know, some of you love to travel. If you get over to Austria, I'll put the connection. Um, and I can't remember his name. I, I apologize, but I'll put the information down. Great beer shop. Uh, this gentleman uh, really helped me out and got me some good beers. Um, anyways, beer all from uh, Austria. Beer all Mountain Pale Ale, 7.3%. I'll put the information down below since I am not reading I'm not reading the label in German very well at all. 
anyways, a real winner. Um, maybe I'll do another review, maybe not. If not, man, we've had a good time here uh, on our little uh, European uh, world tour. Thanks for sharing another beer with me, world. Cheers.